Hit it AC 45. Street Sweeper Radio. DJ K Slade, Drama King in the building. My co host Kimmy J is in the building. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So now, who shot Ghost? <laughs> right? The who shot Ghost thing oh, kind of reminds me of. Uh, yeah, I was oh, like, uh. But, but I don't know if y'all remember, like, well, pretty much, I don't know, Tommy, you look a little, maybe Cooper, maybe, oh, definitely. Who shot JR? 1980. Oh yeah, right. who shot Mr. Burns. You, well, no, you understand what I'm saying? I might look young, but me like, too. Okay, so yeah, you I'm kinda, almost 40. Me you too. Kind of remember that though. from that, and then uh, mm-hmm. I'm almost but, 40. But, but all <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> but all the hype from that when season four came out, it was like 83 million viewers. So like you understand? Like do y'all think that possibly y'all could build the hype up? You understand? So, yeah, they're, I doing, mean, they're like, doing their damnedest. I mean, 50, yeah. 50 keeps building that hype up. He, yeah. he He's nonstop. He's nonstop yeah. motivational hype. You know what I mean? He's, uh, so if the back five are going to get more viewers, it's because fifth is going to keep pumping pumping that agenda. And I think that they we, we've we garnished those that many people because people believe in season six. I mean, you said yourself that, you know, a lot of unexpected happenings in the season. So the writers are doing their job. Hopefully, as actors, we're doing our job. And I definitely know that everybody wants to see what Cooper Sacks is up to right. in season six. Now, Cooper's yes. the most duplicitous dragon snake ass mother. <laughs> Yo, don't know about that. Yo, <laughs> wait, hold on. Cooper Sacks. Now that's what I'm saying. We're gonna touch on Cooper Sacks right now. Now <laughs> Yo, Let's hear it. Let's hear it. <laughs> the unexpected. Once again, Tommy and Ghost busting in, catching you about to get your shit off on Pornhub. You understand what I'm saying? And it's a Tuesday. So you yeah. get, yeah, and you fucking get tied up, B. You understand? And, yeah, and then they just left me there. And they left you there because, I mean. I thought but, that was part of it. I was like, oh, shit, this is getting exciting. And then they just left me there. And then <laughs> nobody's believing the story. I know. Because it's like, like the picture you painted of them, why would they leave you alive? But leading all the way up to that, I mean, uh, from you accusing Donovan, like you you thinking that he did it, like from the uh, Mike uh, Sandoval situation and everything. You and it's like you've just yeah. dragged through so much shit to be where you at now, and now you're no longer a cop. But he's still working. But he still <laughs> won't go. Like, Once a cop, like, always a cop. No, no, yeah, yeah. But this right. is what I'm thinking: is what the fuck is Cooper Sacks? Hard on for Ghost. Ghost didn't do the shit. Like Ghost didn't kill Angela, B. But you're like, I don't give a fuck if like you're almost like I don't care if he did or didn't. He's going down for like you just want him. Then even with the Greg situation, he didn't kill Greg. You had a hard on for him, like, what is Cooper Sacks hard on for Ghost? Well, you know, first of all, I just I do have a knack. Cooper Sacks has a knack for going after James St. Patrick for like the one or two things that he didn't do. He did do everything else, you know. You know okay, you right. I just picking the wrong crimes, but but I know, but he's guilty. Right. He's just not guilty of the shit that I'm, you know, accusing him of. You miss but it. for for me personally, I think that things got um, for Cooper. It started off like it was more about the business of it. Like I wanted to be the boss there. I wanted to um, be right. I wanted to win. And then, um, and so that's why Angela was such a, a thing for me, Go, going through the first like three or four seasons. I wanted to win. And then as the bodies start piling up all around the office, you know, like you said, Sandoval, um, Greg, who was like my friend. Knox, yeah, Greg and, Knox, um, yeah. and then of course I went and hit on Angela two seconds later, but you know, <laughs> as one does, to <laughs> try and help a girl out, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's being a bro. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> sure. but then, then I think after, uh, I think after this thing with Angela, um, I think shit just became really personal all of a sudden. So I think now it's, it's a vendetta rather than just like, oh, I'm trying to do my job, which is why him being fired is irrelevant because it's a deeper thing. It's a personal thing that I have to take this man down. Otherwise, everything, my whole existence is is, is bullshit. You know? but, but you're setting Blanca Rodriguez up. You set her up with that fucking phone. You understand what I'm saying? Like, you're getting her jammed up with your bullshit. It's like, and what I'm, what I'm trying to say is now it's like, you're about to fucking go do time. 
Like, when do you stop? <laughs> like, where's the, you know what? I'm losing myself. I lost my job. I'm jamming other people up. You understand what I'm saying? Like, it, they could have killed me. They didn't kill me. Like, where, where's the where's the, the end line? At? They should have. They should have killed me? No, no, they should have. No, they should have. No, really. How else are you going to stop? No, no, I, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> they should have killed Cooper Sacks, not Shane M. Johnson. Yeah, right, they right, they right. should have killed Cooper Sacks. They should have did that. They spared you, but instead Tommy of Tommy wanted to. Tommy was yeah, like, yeah. What, what are you thinking? Let's do this. <laughs> right. Tommy wanted to fucking, uh, he always wanted to fuck. he wanted to kill Lobos and Ghost was the one like, no, like Tommy is the no, like, foot off the gas. If there's He's, any doubt, oh, just kill him. It's, yeah. it's, it's just kill him. Exactly. <laughs> He's always been that way. But, Tommy says we can do anything you want to do as long as it's <laughs> kill that guy. <laughs> <laughs> but, but Cooper, man, like, I'm just saying, like, and once again, your your character is great because people hate you. Yeah. When people you obtain you that level of hate, me. you understand? <laughs> <laughs> my, my my parents won't answer the phone. <laughs> <laughs> I said, stop <laughs> watching the show, bro. <laughs> I was about to say, wait, in, really real life, in real life, do you get people that comment on your page like you ain't shit? Why would you do that? Yes. Oh, oh, yeah. Do y'all yeah. think any of y'all have that? They issue? think yeah. this is real. They yeah, think it's sure. actually <laughs> yeah. real. They like you snitched. Like right. no, they wrote that in the. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. It's time that I had to catch myself. With, yo, <laughs> if I ever see that little motherfucker show. Tariq, like I'm gonna tell him, like, and I'm like, no, Slade, this is just a show. But he is just like the epitome of a fucking bad kid. <laughs> like, bad like kid. a bad, like you're great. great. Like, and that's what I'm saying. When you get that yeah, way, right. they're doing what they're supposed exactly. to do. Yeah, like this fucking kid, man. You know, even he steals. He. He fucking lies. Like, like he, he does makes money. everything. Yeah, he hustles. He does, like, like, but his like, acting is so subtle that you don't really know how talented he is. It's like it, it's like it's so small but mm -hmm. it's so big at the same time. He's incredible. He's incredible. No. But he did a skit like that though. It was a, a comedian that did it with him. Like elevator. this is what you want to do when you On see him. Elevator, you want to whoop right? his ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see the elevator. Yeah, yeah, I see that. He's like, bro, it's not real. Yeah. Yeah. Like, so nah, we did one too. I did one too. I started. I did one too. With I was saying that everybody, because everybody, I'm from Jersey. I'm from Newark. So everybody asked me, yo. Did yo put tell Fifty to put me on? Like I don't have Fifty's number at all. Like he doesn't even, <laughs> he doesn't even oh, follow me. Like you know what I'm saying he doesn't even follow me on Instagram. Yeah. I just got like eleven thousand followers. Like I'm not that person. But they don't Stop care. Stop bragging, dude. Now I'm just saying. Take it easy, well, that's man. not even. That's a, that's a little bit. Like that don't even mean nothing. Somebody might have bought those for me. I don't even know. <laughs> but no, for real. Like that's what they think. They really think it's real. I'm like, oh, nah, yeah. for real. Like this is different. I I, I want to get another role so bad because I just want to know. I just want them to know it's not. It's yeah. not real. It's not me. Yeah. <laughs> I don't wear what glasses. Is, wear glasses that you can't see shit. Yeah. I don't wear them. What the fuck? Hey, listen, Yo, the fuck? I know, look, I'm good. Yo, <laughs> them, them glasses is like this. Yeah, I know. They I'm is. sorry. Yeah. Them yeah. just big. Yeah. Them just yeah. like it. Just, and it was weird because yeah. the first time I picked them, the first time I thought they fit right. You know what I'm saying? And then it was like action, and then it came down. I was saying, and then <laughs> I started pushing them up all the time, and then it became part of the character. So. It was all good. <laughs> I love it. I so, mean, it's so crazy that I'm, I'm getting, I was telling Joe about this today, is there Serbian people are sending me videos of their sons with guns. Yeah. And say, yo, listen, you need help? Let me come help you, you know? It's um, anything you need, I come, I come bring it for you, you know? The Serbs. Yeah. And I'm just like, okay, guys, it's not real. It's not real. But you know when I knew you was in trouble, uh, Jason, I, I kind of felt it. It's when your partner told you the second time to take, take the, the gun. Yes. Yes. Like that. So I'm thinking you took it. Cause he's, the like, second well, he's like, I got a watch. I don't need a gun. Yeah. I, this watch. I had this yeah, fancy like watch. A... And, and, you know, the way I look at it is Jason at that point thought he's invincible. Right. Mm. So he thought he could handle himself physically with anyone. He wasn't concerned about anything. And, and it was one mistake that he did in the elevator. He was winning. And then one mistake where he slipped and... He got mm -hmm. headbutted, and that's where the tables turned. He I, underestimated I, I, Ghost. I thought right. Ghost ass was out. Once you that that little thing y'all got to come out that watch, whatever that shit is. Once you, I said, oh the shit, garage. he's over. <laughs> and then once it turned around, I was like, man. But fucking back to Tommy. Yeah, because yeah, mm -hmm. you were supposed to put the gun in the uh, yeah. the thing, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I remember that. But, one. but but you know one thing about Tommy, Tommy. 
blames people for shit they didn't do. Like, yeah, he, he does. He does. Like, he Lobos, does. all the way yeah. back to Lobo. Yeah, well, like, not Lobos, uh, uh, Ruiz. Yeah. Oh, He's like, I don't care. I just want to kill that motherfucker. Well, yeah, Ruiz. <laughs> and, 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 and that's actually why Proctor got killed. Yeah. Because of the the, the, uh, the footage. Yeah, yeah, that He yeah. had the wire on exactly. when you killed him. Yeah. And then y'all had the laptop. And I guess somebody, who was supposed to get rid of it? You a ghost. 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 And he didn't. And he put, I remember... Proctor putting it inside the safe deposit box. I was like, oh shit, he's holding this shit for insurance. Mm-hmm. This is fucked up. Yep, this is gonna come is. up later on. Right. Right. You understand what I'm yep. saying? Like, but yeah, like Tommy, you fucking you do like you blame uh Ghost for Lakeisha. That was odd there. I said, damn man, he really wants yeah. to just fucking kill Ghost. Yeah, or I mean, if history has proven us correctly, it's very it's gonna be, you know. If indeed we find out that Tommy was the one who was able to pull the trigger on Ghost, that will be an incredible journey that we've never seen of Tommy because we've seen him take a similar journey a few times of trying to kill Ghost and not being able to finish, you know, to accomplish that. So if it was Tommy, it would be certainly something that the audience has never seen before and there would have to be show the reasoning behind how Tommy was able to switch that or go that final step. Um, that said, I think that Tommy, um, it, you know, Tommy Tommy has a vendetta. He just makes a vendetta with most people. Almost everybody but Ghost. Almost or or whatever woman he like loves in his life or who he considers family. But even like anybody who he works for, he's like just let me see you fuck up. Just mm-hmm. let me see. He's a terrible boss and he's a micromanager. <laughs> right. He, and he's a micromanager because yeah. he's like y'all fucking this shit up. You don't know how to do shit. I'm going to do everything myself. And you're like that's not smart, you know, <laughs> necessarily. But Tommy gets frustrated, and he's like, nobody knows how to do it. I know how to do it best. So he goes, and he's a micromanager. And I think that's, you know, everybody hates their boss when they're like that. But, but, what do you but, think but, Tommy you know, is going to do when he finds out Tasha actually killed? Uh, but, but we don't know if we gonna, we don't know that yet. I'm asking you. What do you think I, Tommy what, is going to Talking to the mic. You've been here long enough. I said, so, what do you think Tommy is going to oh, do? Oh, he's going to fucking try to kill Tasha. He doesn't give a fuck about, like, what is somebody he loves. Right. Let me tell you what's crazy. Not a whole about, lot of trying with Tommy. But, <laughs> let me tell you, let me, but let me tell you the one thing that's crazy about you and Ghost. You can fuck over Ghost. Ghost can fuck over you. But if something happened to y'all together, y'all gonna try to kill the person while y'all got beef. Yeah. And then like, even, are they the same person? Like, you know, in some ways, they're two sides of the same coin. Tommy ooh. and Ghost are the night and the day, the yin and the yang of a lot of things, uh, escapism mm. and staying put. And so, the, you know, they kind of, in a lot of ways, it's it's evolved into Tommy is Ghost and Ghost is Tommy. So, That's real. you, you know, what's gonna happen? Different. It seems to me that the thing that always always exists with Tommy is that no matter what he's doing he does he seems to the audience forgives it almost mm-hmm. immediately because he's doing it from a place of like love and heart he's just got like this big heart yeah. so mm-hmm. even when he's Absolutely. like killing his girl you're kind of like <laughs> I get it you know right right whereas ghost is like methodical and like yeah. clinical about that shit and so you're yeah. kind of like shit man yeah. uh, you know it's, it's just a different you know what I mean so when it comes to the yin and yang I think the heart and the brain are the two yeah uh, two different yeah. people operating yeah and Tommy is honest Ghost is a liar like Tommy is Ghost is old one yeah, yeah. He's, a li- he's, he's you know he's, he's very like okay even if I'm emotional like I'm being honest in my you know what I mean like yeah. I honestly feel this way that's how we moving like whether it's wrong or not you know Ghost is always lying. You don't need. Ghost doesn't even know if he's fucking telling the truth to himself. Did he even, even cop the killing roller? Did he? Did Never. He, did he have, no, even? No. No, Never. Did, did, did he even? Shariq. Yeah, but but yeah, I was saying like, but to Tommy, Shariq. like, did oh. he ever? Did, did, like, cause this and this is just now. Like, did he ever? Like, I don't recall yeah, him. Yeah, he was. I mean, he, that was kind of the that was an impetus in season two for him being kind of starting to distance himself, himself from Tommy because Tommy convinced him that it was Roller. And even Tommy was even just like, and if it ain't Rolla, Rolla's not coming, he's not coming right. So right. Like, who gives a fuck either way? This guy's right. got to be gone. Right. And it's just, it's overly harsh for somebody that you love, regardless of your, regardless of street rules, regardless of anything. We're human beings and we show mm. each other that time and again that there are exceptions and we make exceptions and we should make exceptions. We shouldn't always judge people by their worst mistake and that's a fault of Tommy's. He right. does judge people by their worst right. mistake. And it ain't say four five Street Sweeper Radio. I got five of the dopest actors in power. Wow. And actors in general, yeah, you know what I'm saying? yeah, like, they, they, in general, they, because they, and I, I, I want to, yeah, and I want to, <laughs> I want to just slide across the room for a second because I remember um, 
Before I seen Power, what Boardwalk Empire? Boardwalk mm. Empire. Right and um, um, hold up, hold up, hold up. What's Banshee? Banshee. Mm. Banshee. Mm. Banshee. Dog. I'll talk about a departure. Yeah. Mm. What was it? Strike. What was the name? Uh, Sharp. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Sharp was a motherfucker. Yo, he was. You know, true that detectives. was one of true detectives yeah. was cool too. But hold up, but Sharp was the first time that I ever asked a showrunner, like, let me talk. Like, they gave me the role, and you know, I'm nobody. And I'm like, yeah, before I say yes to the role, can I like talk to the writer? And can we make him smarter? Because <laughs> smart, smart racists people are fucking the freakiest, weirdest shit in the world. You're like, mm -hmm. dumb people, you're like, all right, you're a fucking idiot, all right, you're racist. I mean, it makes sense with ignorance. Right. But if somebody's smart, you're like, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> sure. yeah. What what yeah. what twilight zone am I in that somebody right. is that's actually intelligent could still be racist, which is obviously the dumbest, most idiotic thing possible in the world. You're just like this. So these people that are smart is the scariest thing to me. And I'm like, if you can make him smarter, it will actually terrify people. Yeah. Mm. Real talk. Mm. Good choice. Okay. Warning, 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 The Drama King is in the building. The Drama King is in the building.